Hey, what's going on, everybody? Got ourselves another senior softball bat. We got the Mike and Kirby Murphy one piece bat, guys. I don't remember the last one piece they did. I want to say it was the Mike and Ultra. That's this. That's the last one piece senior bat that I remember them doing. Um, it's going to be just me and Dakota out there under the lights, guys. Sorry, Chad's not. Chad's out of town, so it's just going to be me. So just give me a fair warning. It's just going to be me swinging, but um, we're going to go test this bat real quick, and after that, we're going to put some swings on it, and then at the end, man, I'm going to let you know what I think of this bat. So let's get started. All right, guys, let's test this Mike and Murphy senior bat. 1450. 1450 is 220 on my tester, guys. Yep, 220. Kirby Murphy bat, Mike and... All right. Hey. It's the other way around. You gotta stand on the other way around. Say hey. Stand back and say hey. Hey. All right, let's go. Let's go pick. Ooh, I hope it's all right. Dakota, and I are back out here at Zebulon Community Park. It's a 325 foot fence all the way around. Guys, we're only hitting one ball that night. We're hitting the Dudley Hardcores. And weather wise, we couldn't ask for better weather tonight. It was 70 degrees. This does not feel like the foster. Go ahead, Dakota. Okay, let's go over the Mike and Kirby Murphy senior softball bat. Uh, this is sanctioned for SSUSA, ISA, and USSSA. Guys, you can order these in sizes of 25, 26, 27, and 28 ounces. Um, guys, this features a 12 and a half inch barrel and it's a max load. Max load basically means it's a half ounce in load in Mike and terminology. And this, guys, is the Mike and Kirby Murphy Senior Softball Bat. Doesn't feel soft, but it's not hard either. But the ball oh, has a crisper feel to it. Yeah. Crisper feel for sure. Let's go. All right, guys, let's uh, scale the Kirby Murphy bat. This is a 27 ounce coming in at 26.8 ounces. Let's get that end load. 18.1 on the end. Eight, nine on the hands, guys. And that is with a different grip, and I'll go over that later.
cat. Stay inside of it. There you go. Then it's good stuff. Alright guys, we are going to do the final testing on the Kirby Murphy. Alright, that is testing at shit, 1200. 1200 is 160 guys, 160. All right, guys, saw me and Dakota just finish up swinging the Mike and Kirby, the Kirby Murphy bat. Um, first thing first, let's go to loading real quick. A 18 one here, just below nine on the hands. Now, that's a big, hefty half ounce end load for Mike and Mike and Max loads usually run a kind of light. This felt like a really heavy half ounce end load and not so heavy that I would go down as I stay where you're at on this. This feels really good and it may help because it's a 12 and a half inch barrel. So all the weights up here and you got a lot more handle here. Now, with that being said, it has a 12 and a half inch barrel that came in in compression at about 220, dropped down to 160, but that was with well over 250 swings on it. But the ball jumps off this thing man this has a huge sweet spot from swing one this thing felt good and i know the big question was is hey is this the foster you know they're all rollins or they're gonna make this this stuff the same this does not feel like the foster this is not as soft as the foster in my opinion but it still has a softer barrel but i would say it's maybe a medium barrel but honestly man i wouldn't put a lot of swings on it now i was hitting dudley hardcores and that's a hot ass it's a pro m ball but that's a hot that's a hot ass bat and they're and they're a little bit heavier than some other bats so it helped break this in so i did hit some other balls with this now that friday night i went out there and hit it was i had brand new balls it was 70 degrees and anything would have felt good that night went out there the second night it was about it was a little bit like a little bit warmer so in the mid 70s same thing bat the ball was flying off this thing so i said man i need to go hit this in the heat see if it's any good so i went out there tuesday night it was in the well above in the 90s and Ball still jumped on this off this thing, man. And I could just sit there and poke this thing, man, and the ball would just sell off this bad dude. This is a good one, man. I'm telling you. And nah, uh, that many swings, no seams. And yeah, it was me hitting it, but I was hitting some deadly hardcores, which is a little bit heavier ball. So guys, you could pick these up at Smash It Sports. Use my discount code fat guy BP. Save yourself some money. But I'm telling you guys, I think you might want to put this one in your bag. I'm dead serious. Uh this one was hot. I mean, I really am. I told Chad about it. I hate Chad wasn't here to hit with me, man. I told Chad about it. He ordered himself one. But, guys, I would definitely take a look at these, guys. This is a must-have. It's almost – it's a foster like that. But, guys, I guess that's it. Until next time, keep hitting it. And, hey, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, reach down there and hit that subscribe button. Okay? We'll talk to you later.